<laughs> Hello. I've had to come out to do this video, on this part of the video. Um, this is going to go on to Ishiar, but it also might go on to the ramblings of Bry with Sea. Um, but I had to come out. My neighbour that touches me is having a brand new bathroom fitted today, so there's lots of plumbers, noise, banging, crashing. Hardly yourself think, and uh, it was scaring Bodhi as well. So it's good to come out and listen to the birds. Oh. Beautiful, nice to hear the birds. I've been very lucky the last two days, very, very lucky. Um, Oh, there's a friend of mine now come in, bless her. She'll want to chat. I'll tell you what, Boat, we go this way, we'll avoid her because she hasn't seen me yet. <laughs> Avoiding people. Been very lucky the last two days. Yesterday morning, um, I got out of bed. I always do the same thing. Boat is always a bit excited to see me, so I give him a little cuddle and say good morning to him. He's on his couch. And, um, I then go into the kitchen, first thing I do is put the kettle on. And uh, what I do, I stand in silence, I look out, look at the sky, look at the trees, and just have a few moments of absolute silence. That's what I do every morning. Just wait for the kettle, and just being, just, that's what I do. It's nice, important part of the day for me really. So, I was stood there, Put the kettle on and then tap 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 at the door and it was the delivery guy with my new hoover i've got a henry hoover oh, exciting i know <laughs> um good boy so hello stayed in bed one more minute I, I would have had to jump out of bed and get dressed and rush around and what have you but i was just stood there next to the door you know so that was very, very lucky. And today the plumbers arrived for my neighbor to his new bathroom and shower unit, etc., etc. He's having the whole lot, the toilet, the shower, everything fitted, sink and all the rest of it. Um, so there's lots of work and lots of noise, but that's fine because we've been up and about the last hour and uh, it just started making a lot of noise. Bodhi got concerned and I said, oh, I'll tell you what, mate, let's take you out. Lovely snowdrops. See them? So, um, where's my friend? Has she gone? Oh shit, she's coming my way now. Oh no, it's somebody else. Come here, Boat. Here. Ready? Good boy. Okay, I'll continue this in a sec. While we're playing. You are a good boy, look at him. Are you ready? Oh, good boy, come on then. Oh, we've got somebody there. Somebody there. Come this way. And then my friend at the top. Very busy. Yeah, so we decided to go out. So I got ready, just as I'm about to leave. Tucked us half at the door. My new camera. Hello! Has arrived. So, um... I said hello to that dog there. I can see him. No, perhaps not. Ready? Hey, good boy. <laughs> Beautiful, isn't it? Absolutely wonderful. Do you remember this time last year? It was the beast from the east. <laughs> No, chance with him. no, he's like a little no rocket. <laughs> yes, yeah, wonderful today, isn't it? Oh, Just what great. we want. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Come on then. Is it a border collie? Yeah, well, he's a border collie cross. cross yeah, I don't know yeah, what he's crossed yeah. with. He's not got the long ear, that's it. No, the way he runs, he's likely to be crossed with a bloody whippet or something, you know? <laughs> <laughs> or a rocket. Oh, yeah, he's, he's certainly got that movement, isn't he? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, he flies round. Yeah. Oh, look at that. 
God bless him. Unbelievable. The, 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 the timing and everything. Oh, absolutely. He knows the distance I'm going to throw it as well. And he always runs and stops. So cool. Yeah, they are. They are clever. Yeah. Come on, Pip. <laughs> Take care, mate. Enjoy your day. Ready? Up. Good boy. Got more people coming now. Up that way. You're a cheeky boy. Gotta wait for these people to finish. So anyway, where was I? Yeah, so my new camera arrived just as we were about to leave. <coughs> so lucky for two days. Ready? Good boy. Come closer. Good boy. Morning. 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 Good boy. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Ready? Can we go this way? <laughs> wow, lots of people around. Somebody said the other day, um, the woods I go to, my local woods, these ones, are lovely because there's nobody there. Today, it's full of people. So yeah, very lucky to get my, um, my hoover just when I woke up and very lucky just before we left to get my camera today. I haven't even opened the box. I'll do that later today. Okay, so this video, I don't know which channel it's gonna go up on now, really, because uh, we've been chatting. Anyway, whatever, let's carry on. Um, I wanted to talk in this video, because I was originally gonna make this for a Shi'ar, as I say, it might go up on both channels. Um, how to price a piece of art. It's very, very difficult, because one of my neighbors that I don't know very well, uh, wants a piece of art off me and he's going to come around on Tuesday and have a look see what I've got I think I've got three pieces that I could possibly sell and uh, he tapped today a bit of a nuisance but he tapped today and he said can I have a look at the piece of art I said no not till Tuesday I have told you you know because um, I'm not ready <sighs> out of breath so he said, how much you want? And I said, well, I normally put them up for around 50 pounds. Um, but you know, I can knock a fiver off because you're my neighbor, 45. And he said, is that it? He said, I was thinking about a hundred quid. And I said, well, it's very nice of you. I said, I do. You know, sometimes they, they do go up to that sort of price, but uh, I'm happy with the three that I've got in mind. You know, we're doing for 40 quid, 45 quid. He said, no, I want to pay hundred quid. I said, well, you haven't seen the piece yet. Come around Tuesday, uh, I'll show you the piece and we'll discuss money then. Um, and he said, well, anyway, it's under a quid. So off he went, really, with that, which is fine, you know. I won't be accepting 100 quid. Um, these three pieces I've got in mind, they're probably worth somewhere from 40 to 70, I would say. So... Uh, you know, if I got 40 quid or 50 quid off him, I'd be more than happy. But how to price a piece of art is a very difficult thing. There's videos on it and people have been discussing it forever more. It's worth whatever it is worth to the buyer, to the purchaser, you know. Um, there's a lot of people say uh, so much per square inch, like you know, five pound per square inch and that sort of thing. If I did that, you know, then my painting is probably worth 200 pounds. So what I do, I, I think about the time and the effort and materials and combine all of that really and just look at it and think what it's worth. I normally put a starting price of around 50 to 55 pounds for the 10 by 12s. Reason how I've come by that is I think very minimal price but three pounds per hour um, take three days to do a piece at probably six ish hours per day um, you know is somewhere between really 40 and 80 pounds 
so I kind of go midway-ish and I start really about 55 and so yeah, sunshine, Mr Solar Face is lovely so that's so how I come by my prices really, I think about £3 per hour which when you think about it for a, an original unique piece of work for £3 per hour you know even if well, whatever job you do in life, you're doing it for more than three pounds per hour. But um, so that's how I get my prices, really. Just I'd discuss that. Yeah, if I work for five hours in a day at three pounds, uh, 12, 15, that's 15 quid, isn't there? Times three days, which is 45 quid, so plus materials is 50 pounds. That's how I work out a piece pounds per hour not a lot to ask for I don't think but hey ready go um, that's it really so I don't know whether to put this up I might put this up on both channels then perhaps I don't know um, I am trying to do a premiere every Tuesday evening on it at 7 p.m. if you'd like to join me over there or not whatever uh, have a great day it's a beautiful day Go outside, come alive. Take care then, be well.